the like these different play styles and and just some crazy stuff that like because I feel like so no in my opinion players, but I feel like lower level players have a tendency to just be more wild with some of their options and I love it. Right, and in my opinion, I think the latter format, like in order to get into the top eight bracket, brings out the big grinders. Uh, because like a, a top player, like they, they probably aren't going to want to play, you know, like 16. I've seen some people with like 40 sets on the ladder. Uh, they're they're so not going crazy. to do that. Like there, there are top players who I've seen complain, complain about like playing five sets in pools. So none of them are going to like do the ladder. So we get to see a lot of different talent coming out. And all of that sure. talent are the big old grinders like Beast Mode Paul right here. Getting the dash attack on the air dodge back to ledge to close out that first stock. Yeah, dude. And that was just a matter of using that back air for, and you know, the nair. Just look at these aerials, man. They're putting down so much damage. They're creating so much pressure. And just problems for Ness in general, man. Ness tends to struggle with those disjoints. You know, he is a moving hitbox for sure. But, like, if you just have a, a, a move that's not attached to your body, you're kind of going to go through that. I mean... <laughs> It's the it's the disjoints, right? Like that's the one of the biggest things that people talk about so much in Smash in general. Oh, and his zoom's going to come out and save his life. How mm -hmm. lucky was that? Oh, um, dude, that's just hero, man. <laughs> but uh, like disjoints, that makes your character infinitely better. Just having any form of disjoint, because when the hit box isn't part of the hurt box, you're in good shape. For sure, yeah. And another another zoom? zoom. I think when you're off stage, you have like a better chance of zoom popping up. Yeah, anyway, there's. So. I know there's a whole lot of RNG manipulation that's possible with Hero. I just don't know a lot about it, so I'm just gonna keep calling it lucky. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's fair. The back throw not gonna kill there. You know, maybe the up throw probably would've been better. Either way, gonna close it out with a nice little forward air right there. But 43% extra credit for Beast Mode Paul. And can he absorb the snooze for like for health? I don't know if snooze counts as an energy projectile. Um, it's definitely a projectile. That's an interesting question. Um, okay, so see right there. You see how the fast that sizzle came out? And mm -hmm. like, this- Oh, oh no! That's a big stock. Oh my god. So anyway, so that's one of the things I was trying to talk about earlier, is sizzle is really, really fast, and Ness can't really react to that with a magnet, you know? So that's kind of one right. of the situations where, where Hero is just kind of like, I don't care about your magnet, dude. <laughs> right, Ness has to rely on reading those options. Like, you have to throw out the down B as soon as the menu opens up, really, if you want to react to it in that in that format. And if you do that, that gives Hero the opportunity to pick something that's not that while you're stuck there holding your magnet out like a rube. Now, with Oomph on the... Or I think that's Psych Up. I actually, I'll be real with you, I can't tell the difference between the red glowy moves. Um, <laughs> Dude, they both they both do the same thing. Like one, I don't know, one kind of hits harder, I guess, but like so both... Oomph both I think I might be completely mixing. Oh, oh my god! Oh, that's so, the oomph, stock. Oomph is one hit. Psych up is like a uh, like a buff for a certain period of time. That's yeah, but it also but it also um, it's not it breaks strong. your shield and kills you. That's what no, it does. The, the, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that that is true. Yeah, no. Uh, any anytime like this is how I see it, right? If I'm fighting a hero and I see I see him glowing red, I just run. I will not shield on him. <laughs> yeah, just run. <laughs> just run. It's like. Just run. <laughs> It's Arsene, like, it's like Arsene. Arsene. Yeah, no, that's what I was about to say. It's like Arsene. Get away from him. You're not going right. to win that fight. He's better you're, you're than you're not. you. <laughs> yeah, I think, you, you know, use your projectiles, use those PK thunders, just find a way to harass him. Because, dude, it's just, it's just, there's no point. There's no point in just fighting that. <laughs> no, in my, in my opinion, there are a few moves in this game that when they're active, they make a character go up a tier. Deep breathing, Arsene, and like 90% of Heroes menu, right? Mm -hmm. I don't think that 90% is a bit of an over exaggeration, but you get what I mean, right? Right. So when those things are active, they are better than you. Don't fight them. Run. <laughs> yeah, well, I think uh, I think uh, Quick Play Knight's kind of figured that out pretty pretty easily there. So we'll have to see if, okay, you know, they, they can. Uh, <laughs> we'll see. We'll see if they can make a nice adaptation, you know. Indeed, see, but that was an insanely dominant opening performance from Beast Mode Paul here in semifinals. He's definitely looking to go take on Tony Pajamas, and you know, warming up with uh, warming up for Tony Pajamas with another very good, very solid nest isn't the worst thing in the world. He'll at least be ready to go on that matchup. Mm -hmm. I really like that drop through platform up air. Did a lot of work for him here, and this is looking. Very similar to how game one started, already off the bat in virtually the same position, but here we go. Uh, quick play night, getting something started. 
Yeah, that was a lot of nice uh, nice options right there. Just following up with that, you know, hit after hit after hit. Good little combo. Uh, and now has a percentage lead. So this could, you know, go a little bit further here. There we go. Continues to pile on this damage. Great stuff, man. But again, you got to find a way to, to really make it effective, really make it count. Oh, not going to be able to get the grab. Unfortunate because we've seen it, man. As soon as Hero has the option, has the opening, he could kill you. But no, Quick Play Knight going to take the first blood. Great stuff. Ew, nice that little. was 20%. Ooh, and he still, <laughs> he still died. Okay. He still died. He still died. It's fine. Everything's cool. It was always intended. Beast Mode Paul just thinks on another level. Everything is right in the world. <laughs> Ness is dead all as oh. well. <laughs> yeah, kind of. <laughs> really good edge guard from oh. him, uh, from Quick Play Knight here, and Beast Mode Paul isn't going to get the zoom that I know he was looking for. So mm. just going to perish off stage there. Now a full stock advantage from uh, Quick Play Knight here. It's definitely mm. a potential to take the game if he keeps up this momentum. Yep, this could be huge. And you know what? You also you, you want that game because you can force it into a game three because, you know, if he drops this game right here, that's kind of it. You go down to the loser's bracket and you just got to fight your way back. Uh, but, ooh. Oh, we I, almost got the answer to our question, but we yeah, didn't dude, fight. I just want to know. I just want to know. Oh, okay. That was you weird. See, you saw what I saw there too, right? Yeah, dude, the, the elements is... are battling against each other before our very eyes. <laughs> Wind and lightning. No. <laughs> Coming to a head. <laughs> they are the storm. <laughs> uh, now we just need, um, we need Smash 4 Charizard to bring in Rock Smash to get, uh, get the Earth in here. Dude, I kind of miss Rock Smash, and I'll be honest. <laughs> PK Fire, then we can get Earth, Wind, and Fire. Ooh. Oh, we gotta need something else. Um, anyway, so, ooh, that's almost a big backer, almost closing it out. And you know what? The forward air, that'll do it. That'll do. That'll do, pig. That'll do. Closing it out, going up one, or not up, but tying it up 1-1 one, one in the set is Quick Play Night. He wants the nest ditto. Ooh, Tony Pajamas coming in clutch in the chat, letting us know that you uh, you can absorb it, but you will not heal. Thank you, Tony Pajamas. Interesting. Oh, wait, I know exactly why. It's because healing is based on damage. Right. But I still so, wasn't sure, you know? like News doesn't do damage. So thank you, Tony. Big I shout out. Tony. T Tony's great. That's why Tony is my pick to win the whole thing. <laughs> you know, bias casters, I get him out of here. Listen, I, I just, I call it how I see it. All right. I see Tony pajamas. I say he might win. <laughs> I see, I see Tony. I press like. I press like, I press like. That's just what it comes down to. <laughs> Going into this anyway. game three, do you think they're going to run it back to PS2? I don't know. That's a good answer, Skiff. I think... Dude, the thing is, is like, I feel like with Hero, I feel like Hero's so much more wild than other characters. I think, like, I don't know if there's exactly a good stage for Hero, you know? <laughs> like, it's, it's how does the player feel? Because yeah, has so many crazy options and weird things. I'm sure there is. I just don't know particularly because I don't know necessarily how the whole Hero meta game works because he's just so wild, dude. There's so much happening. So I feel like Hero can abuse different things on different stages. And that'll really just come back, uh, come down to like how good, uh, how good the player is at capitalizing on different advantages. So like on Kalos, Hero can do a really good job of vertical, vertical edge guarding with the up B. Uh, on stages with like wide, wide platforms, they can catch you with fair, fair for an early kill. Or you know, there's so many different things on different stages that Hero can do, and none of it's fair. Mm -hmm. All right, but, well, here we go. Right back to PS2. You know what? I, I, PS2, honestly, I don't think is a bad choice. It's it's a, it's a really good neutral stage in general. But I think, like, what it comes down to is, like, maybe you want to do something that Ness isn't good on. Oh! oh! <laughs> Dude, he DI'd out from the PK fire and then went right back in. <laughs> okay, there it is! We saw it! We finally saw it! He was already at zero, right. so, you know. But, no, I, I believe Tony. I trust in Tony. Believe in Tony. Oh, okay, good up tilt right there. Going to be able to not be going to find anything else, but still just going to put, you know, a good little amount of damage. Missing the back air. It looks like... Oh, and he just kept <laughs> playing. You saw that? Yeah, I respect it. I respect it. Kaklang is like an instant fast fall, isn't it? It just, like, drops yeah. you right down into the blast zone. It's like in like in Melee when they just, like, uh, start and then quit out when they know <laughs> they're going to die. <laughs> right, right, right. Okay, well, let's see if... Uh, this is definitely starting to become a bit of a problem, man. Quick Play Knight is doing a good job here. Good oh, that was 40%. Mm-hmm. That was 40%. Mm -hmm. that yeah, was dude. 40%. Oh, dude, he almost got... 
<laughs> got the hatchet, man, actually. He was really, really close to getting that. Good spot dodge there to avoid the PK fire, but can't find Tony jumping as he wanted him to with that fair. Yeah, it seems dude. like to me, Beast Mode Paul has gone for like every single situation where Tony's off stage. He goes for the same call. He goes for that uh, blocking the high recovery fair. And I think Tony has definitely caught on to that because he hasn't recovered high into it yet. Yeah, okay, there we go. We got something on board right now. Let's see if he can find a way to close out this stock because, boy, he needs that stock out of here, man. This Yee. is Psych Up, by the way. I read it as it popped up. So I know this is Psych Up. He misses the up smash as Tony falls through. Not Tony. Oh. Quick Play Knight falls. Sorry, we got confused with Tony in the chat. That's my mistake. With quick Play Knight catching that good old yo-yo. And yet another heal going to come out. Still sitting at only 60% on the first stock. This is looking all quick play night all the way. Yeah, he did heal 40% earlier, so that was like, that was huge. And now we're just kind of sitting here just, it almost feels like we're waiting for beast mode Paul to just, you know, die here. But no beast mode. We did see a comeback earlier tonight. So who knows, man, beast mode Paul could find a way to do this. Okay, there Back we go. to the stage with the upbeat. He's got a lot of mana in the bank, but Ugh. kneecapped by that bat right there, brought right back towards the stage, and he gets caught air dodging back onto stage. So quick play night. I'm gonna finish it off with a beautiful back air for the JV3 stock. Moving on to winners finals to play the Nest Ditto with Tony Pajamas. Yeah, man, good stuff in general. Uh, quick.